I will defeat the government. The privilege is not the of Christ as a prayer and the deliverance ministry. Revelation that God gave to me about our nation, Nigeria. Of course, we know that I've been one of the prophet, the few prophets in Nigeria who speaks about this country. God spoke to me again, and God said we should pray for Nigeria. We should pray for Nigeria. For peace. We should pray for Nigeria. For peace. We should pray for Nigeria. For peace. I saw Nigeria paying another debt. This debt is as a result of charge. Not Nepal. Charge. Somebody charged them to court, and they have been forced by international court to pay compensation to that person. And it's a huge amount of money. Those who should pray for federal government, that God should give them wisdom. That God should give them wisdom. Most especially on the case of this young man, the leader of the IPO, the Jordan Bikalu. That they should apply wisdom. Those who that should speak to the federal government, our president, His Excellency, President Mahmoud Bari, and the DSS, and those that are involved, should please apply wisdom. There is something God showed me in the spirit. And this thing is not good at all. They should release this man and let him go. So that they will kiss everywhere. They should release this man. People are dying in the northern part of Nigeria. People are dying on daily basis. That you are here, it's not happening to you. It has not happened to your family member, the family that is not happening. They are killed on daily basis. I weep three days ago when God gave me this revelation again. And I said, Lord, I won't say I don't want to be coming out of you. God said, You must speak. You are the Jeremiah of our time. Speak. I've been praying for this nation, I've been praying for Nigeria, I've been praying for everyone that is on top in this country, that God should please help me to uphold them and give them his wisdom to follow. God said that you take another moment to release from the cabin. There should not let that young man die in detention. If he dies in detention, there will be fire that nobody will be able to quench. And I've seen international courts charging federal government a huge amount of money to pay. And if this matter is not handled carefully, so please, our president, we are doing a good job of peace. I beg you. If letting these people go will bring peace to Nigeria, please, we can let the brother go. We can still be brothers, we can still be friends, we can still be good neighbors. I beg you. I beg you. God knows I love my country, Nigeria. I love this nation, and I'm continuing to speak for the progress of this nation. I pray that the hand of God will preserve this nation. God will fight for this nation. I am only a messenger. Please, do not kill me. I have received a lot of threats from different angles. That is why for the past few months, I decided not to come out again. Please, I am only speaking one more session. I have speak. I am not a case to anybody. I, have, I do not know why I am doing that. I love my country. Nigeria is my country. Nigeria is my motherland. So please, do not kill me because God is using me. God will bless you. Those of you that we want you to know and share it to where you're supposed to get to, God will increase you. No evil will be visit you and your household. Amen. If you say amen, it's happening for you now. Amen. In Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Peter Lord's high in Waka. In Waka, well, uh, at least we don't get uh, judgment. Uh, over this matter, where it happened since 2017, where the court don't talk up now, say, no be run away, when I'm the can run away from there. That thing where they call, say, in John Bay, na lie, na because military attack him. And because of that military attack him, the court ordered that the federal government should pay him one billion. And I apologize to him. That's why we came here. And the court agreed with us. The only thing the court did not do is that he said he no get power to decide the thing will happen to Namdekan for Kenya. So that was that side. And the get another thing where the court talk that is very important. You know, under section 12 of the Federal High Court Act, Federal High Court judges have the power to reconnect or order political solution or reconciliation uh, between parties. There is a companion section of provision in the state law. So today, 
the High Court judge recommended, I would say, I have not seen the CTC. It might as well be an order that the federal government, instead of pursuing this matter in court in Abuja, in the form of a trial, should pursue the prospects of political solution. That coming from a High Court judge in Nigeria is very, very important for us. It's of overriding consideration. Okay, for the common man, we're not going to understand all this big grammar. Mm -hmm. yes. How you fit a break them down one by one? Which okay, is I don't need break them. I don't need break them. They, 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 uh, they say that thing they call Python. That's where the Nigerian army come down for Sa East for 2017. Come down Sam City, they call Rich Mazin and the Kano House. For Afaru Quebec, where they for my father say. It's, the judge said that thing no good. He did wrong. Say, now in life, where they want come take. Now he make the man run away. So that no be none they can wait there at fault. Now federal government and the army we come to attack and then they at fault. And now because then they at fault, made them pay one billion naira and made them apologize to them. Okay. Mm. So make now, them tell and say then they sorry. So how you feel for this journey? I if feel you say good everything now. where you where you fight, say they meet all of them complete or you get some ways they pay mm, you. Yes, them. where I know be say they pay me, eh? You can see my face like you can say I don't get paid. No, 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 that's small what we happen for Kenya. Okay? Don't worry, that one we'll see we'll go see what thing we will do. One day monkey will go market and we'll go talk for that one. So okay, so a message for the supporters of Nando. Okay, and I don't see how we leaves too. Uh -huh. and I don't see how we work out go. The people they support Nandekar. This work out for Abia State is that